work has begun at the site of the Moliné land slippage. The road has been closed since 2019, resulting in traffic being diverted through the Mount Morris community. The multi-million dollar project has been undertaken by the St. Lucia-based firm Construction and Industrial Equipment Limited. On Monday, the GIs visited the site at Moliné with Avinash Dabade, CEI project head, and Aslam Sheikh, site manager. Avinash says currently CEI has projects ongoing in Antigua, Dominica and St. Lucia and the Moliné land slippage project is their first in Grenada. For Moliné, this uh, project uh, government has intent to do finance and to, to execute this project. Basically, this is a missing link before the West Corridor. And currently, the package what is awarded by the government to us is from the chain 0 to 630. And the work which is involved in this project is extensive work for the excavation, demolition work, the piling, uh, then backfilling and the pavement part. So uh, initially we are planning to do all the cleaners, uh, general cleaners and after that we will do the demolition and we are using the community people here, local employment has been done and we are carrying out the cleaning activity right now and after this phase get complete we are doing, starting the piling activity. And once it get done, then you will see the retaining wall construction and after that is the pavement work. So these are the basic phases. He says with the project commencing in the 2022 Atlantic hurricane season, his team has already strategized how they will handle the project to minimize any further slippage once the excavation work commences. We can't, uh, we have to work in systematic manner. This is more technical project. So as per our expertise and everything, we are confident to do this project on time with the quality and safety. You mentioned piling and so um, where are you getting these specialized piles from and how soon can we see them on island or are they already on island? No, this uh, piling is a long lead item and it is uh, required to import from other countries. It's coming from the UK. And this piling pile material has been ordered as this uh, project we got the awarded in last uh, before two weeks. So we ordered the material and most probably within next two months you will see the piling will be on the place. The consulting firm, he says, has already erected indicators as to where the excavation should take place. You see the caution tape which has been installed, like when you uh, look at the structures, this is the survey marking has been done. And we, so we are coming up from that portion. We are not going down further. So this is the extent of the project where we have the, put the caution tips. The consultant uh, is MS Beston. Uh, they have designed this project and uh, they are coming with the different kind of technology. It's called the geo grid and the slope stabilization. So where the, this new technology implement and hold ground in firm and they are using the piling technology to hold the strata uh, and they are going up to the hard strata. So this is, as new, new technology will implement in such a way that you will get the fault line, it will encounter everything and this, all the challenges for the slope stabilization will be taken care. CEI has been in the Caribbean for over 15 years, specialized in construction of bridges, roads and handling of slippages.